Undyne, kiss me again, Undyne. <laughs>
right <laughs> when she's right there. Unique letter written for Dr. Alphys. Okay. Well, anything else to say, Papyrus? It's a special letter? Undyne writes a lot of letters, but she can never seem to find the right words. So when she goes to deliver them herself, she always quits so she can go back and rewrite. That's why she asked you. Because you have no standards. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still wondering if that's all for Sans there. Because the other one, it was Papyrus' mailbox, right? Does he just right? not check his mail? I don't know. He's too busy selling hot dogs and teleporting between screens. Okay, let's head back all the way to Hotland here. There we go. We still haven't tried going to Waterfall, which maybe we should do sometime. But uh, I do like going to Hotland. After we leave Snow Snowden, it just really seems like it's always a dog boat. Ta la la, what's my name? It doesn't really matter. <laughs> Please, I'd, I'd rather not talk while we ride the dog boat. <laughs> An awkward ride. <laughs> All the way back to Hotland. All right. Come again sometime. Tra la la. So let's see. Can we get in the lab now or? Oh. The door has no mail slot. Slide the letter under. Yes. You slide the letter under the door and give it a knock. Mm -hmm. Alphys, we know you're in there. Oh, oh no, no. Is that another letter? I don't want to open it. Can I just slide it back out? Oh, she had a lot of letters from, like, monsters. Yeah. Is she, like, the uh, the like most eligible bachelorette? She's, like, avoiding something. N no, I can't keep doing this. I'll read this one. Um, it's shut kind of strongly, isn't it? <laughs> Wait a second. I'm opening it now. <laughs> Whoa! Laser sealed. Is she sealed. okay? Hey, if this is a joke, it's... Oh my god, did you write this letter? It wasn't signed, so I had no idea who could have... Oh my god, oh no. <laughs> That's adorable. And I had no idea you um wrote that way. It's surprising, too, after all the gross stuff I did. What? I don't really deserve to be forgiven. Oh, betraying us with the whole setup, I guess. Much less, um, this? And so passionately, too. <laughs> you know what? Okay, I'll do it. It's the least I can do to make it up to you. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Let's go on a date. Ah! Uh. Misconstrued letter. Dating start. Uh, I guess. Hmm. Ah, uh, sorry. I'm still getting dressed. <laughs> Watch TV. Oh. Uh. <laughs> Aw. Didn't it say she had, like, a bunch of lab coats in one dress or something, right? Yeah. When we looked at her closet or whatever. How do I look? My friend helped me pick out this dress. She's got a great sense of... Um, anyway, let's do this thing. Dating start. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, wait. Actually, we still can't start the date yet. Dating stop. <laughs> um, I've got to give you items to raise your affection statistic first. <laughs> That'll increase the chance of success outcome to the get date. <laughs> right? Anyway, don't worry. I'm prepared. I've been stockpiling gifts in anticipation for a get date like this. First, I've got uh, some metal armor polish. Hey, that oh. would work a lot better. <laughs> oh no. Uh, maybe you can't use that. But... I also brought some waterproof cream for your scales. <laughs> your, Humans. uh, scales. Humans have scales, right? Uh, well, how about this magical spear repair <laughs> kit that I, uh, um, hey, let's forget about the items. Let's just start the date. Dating start. Yeah, let's, um, date. Oh, her heart's not in it with us. Just like everyone else we've tried to date in this game. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
Oh, she's breaking out or something. Uh, she's do nervous. you like anime? <laughs> yes. You mean human history? <laughs> hey, me too. If she really liked it, she'd say anime. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Where? But where's a good place to go on a date? Hmm. I've got it. Let's go to the garbage dump. <laughs> My favorite place. It's where all the couples are making <laughs> out. All right. Oh, is that where she gets her anime? Because it's that's where we found the Maybe. One DVD. Here we are. She scratched it all up. This is where Undyne and I come all the time. We find all sorts of great stuff here. <laughs> She's really uh. Mm. Oh no. That's her over there. I can't let her see me on a date with you. Hide me in this trash can. W why? Because, uh, well. Oh no, here she comes. Oh. <laughs> She's all dressed up too. Yeah. Hey, there you are. Oh, she probably thought that, yeah. I, uh, realized if you deliver that thing. It might be a bad idea. So I'm gonna do it. Give it to me. Huh? You don't have it? Nah. Have you at least seen her? Uh, yeah. Yes? So she's somewhere around here. Uh oh. Thanks. I'll keep looking. <laughs> this is a regular <laughs> sitcom situation. <laughs> oh my god. Well, I, I guess it's obvious, huh? I, uh, I really like her. Oh. I mean, more than I like other people. I'm sorry. I just figured, you know, it'd be fun to go on, like, a cute kind of pretend date with you to make you feel better. Well... It sounds even worse when I put it like that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I messed up again. Undyne's the person I, um, really want to go on a date with. We're the angel of love, I guess. <laughs> the prophecy. <laughs> but, I mean, she's way out of my league. Real love, not levels. Not that you aren't, um, cool. But Undyne, she's so confident strong and funny and I'm just a nobody. She listening to all of this? A fraud. I'm the royal scientist, but all I've ever done is hurt people. I've told her so many lies. She thinks I'm... She thinks I'm a lot cooler than I actually am. Mm -hmm. If she gets close to me, she'll... She'll find out the truth about me. What should I do? Tell her the truth. The truth? But if I tell her that, she'll hate me. Isn't it better this way? To live a lie where both people are happy? <laughs> or a truth where neither of us are? They say be yourself, but I don't really like who myself is. I'd rather just be whatever makes people like me. People learn the truth on their own. They'll all get hurt because of me. But how can I tell Undyne the tr truth? I don't have the confidence. We're here. We'll hide behind the trash can and feed you lines. <laughs> I'm gonna mess it up. How can I practice? We'll be your Cyrano. Uh, <laughs> obviously, it's role play. It's the same. Yeah. Let's role play it. R role play? Get your 20-sided die, Alphys. That actually sounds kind of fun. Okay, which one of us will be undying? I'll be undying. <laughs> oh, right. Obviously. <laughs> uh, um, hi, Undyne. How are you doing today? You're cute. <laughs> <Th> thanks. <laughs> you say that to me a lot, and I never know what to say. Aww. But I know you just mean it platonically because we're just friends. <laughs> uh, 
so I'd like to, um, talk to you about something. What is it, Alphys? Then <laughs> 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 she kisses you. What? Auntie would never. Uh, I kiss her back. <laughs> softly. <laughs> I look gently into her eyes. I start hollering! <laughs> Undyne, I love you! Undyne, kiss me again, Undyne! <laughs> um. What did you just say? Uh, Undyne, I was just... Hey, whoa, wait a second. Your outfit's really cute. What's the occasion? Wait a second. Are you two on a date? Uh, yes! Huh, no! I mean, uh, no! I mean, we were, but, I mean, actually we were only romantically role-playing as you! What? I mean, I mean, and then I... I've been lying to you. What? About what? About, well, everything. I told you that seaweed was... Really, I just like to use it to make ice cream. And those human history books I received, there's just really dorky comics and history movies. Those, those are just uh, anime, and they're real. <gasps> and that time I told you I was busy with work on the phone, I was just eating some frozen yogurt. Elvis. <laughs> Your pajamas. <laughs> I, I just wanted to impress you. I just wanted to think I was smart and cool. And I wasn't some nerdy loser. Elphys. <laughs> you're my nerdy loser. <laughs> Undyne, I, I really think you're neat, okay? Elphys. She gently puts the fin <laughs> of flippers yeah. in her mouth. <gasps> Stranglehold. Whoa! Uh what? Alphys! I... I think you're neat too, I guess. What happened there with the net? <laughs> but you've got to realize, most of what you said really doesn't matter to me. I don't care if you're watching kid cartoons or reading history books. To me, all that stuff is just nerdy crap! What I like about you is that you're passionate, you're analytical. It doesn't matter what it is, you care about it. A hundred percent at maximum power. <laughs> <laughs> so, you don't have to lie to me. I don't want you to have to lie to anyone anymore. Elphys, I want you to help, I want to help you become happy with who you are. And I know just the training. You need to do that. Get out of that trash can, you little <laughs> um, dinosaur. You? You're gonna train me? Ha! What? Me? <laughs> <laughs> no. It's the jar boy. Nah, I'm gonna get Papyrus to do it. Get those bones shaken. It's time to jog 100 laps, hooting about how great we are. Ready? I'm about to start the timer. I'm doing... I'll, I'll do my best. The trash can is like weed clothing. <laughs> oh my god. She was kidding, right? Those cartoons, those comics, <laughs> those are still real, right? The world is shattered. <laughs> Anime's real. Right? Uh, Tell her it's real. Sure. <laughs> I knew it. Gigantic swords! Magical princesses! Here I come! <laughs> as long as you don't ask any other humans, it's real. Uh, thanks for taking care of Elphys. I didn't get to say what I wanted to, but... Things seem like they're going to get better for her. Well... I gotta go catch up with them. Later. <laughs> Whoa, we're back here Woo. at the flowers. So was that Flowey talking to us when we fell, or I'm trying to remember. Like that was a while ago too. Either way, we have uh, helped. Oops, we've helped 
two people get together, bubbling till the end. <laughs> How do we get out of here, though? Ooh, is this is the beat up computer? Oh, we could get more of this. We got astronaut oh, boy. food. Do we have? Oh, we had room. Yeah. Okay. There's that scratch DVD case. <laughs> Desperate claw marks, like, like uh, oh. Alphys is trying to get it. Howdy! If it isn't my good friend who trusts me, <laughs> this is Papyrus. You're also a mutual friend. Alphys and I finished our training early. Very early. So I sent her home. Just rolled the trash can <laughs> down to the hot one. Very home. Uh, now, I feel strongly, and for no apparent reason, you should also go there. To her lab house. I have only good feelings about this. Goodbye. Hmm. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Guess we're out of here. There we go. She's okay. All right. Thank you guys for watching. Episode 21, where Danny goes on a date with herself. <laughs> Please leave a like if you enjoyed this. And next time, we're headed back to Alphys' lab, I guess. We'll drop in on our buddy here. Naps to Blue, how you doing? Still you doing, buddy? making music. Uh, I'm going to keep working on that mix CD. You do that, buddy. We'll see you guys <laughs> next time for more Undertale. Goodbye. Bye.